Hello everybody and welcome. I am the Beta Plan and this is Arustaralalaya, our Aboriginal Oceanian country. And uh, well, I was thinking about going to war against the Indians, but I had apparently forgotten that you don't need everything in the same bloody area in order to, uh, well, for California. So let's not do this right now. Because although I may be able to win against them, I don't have a lot of troops, effectively, here just yet. And um, I'm a little bit afraid, actually, of their allies. Because they have, if I may, uh, I'm allowed to look at them, they have the Navajo. The Navajo. And I believe the Navajo is a quite a big Indian nation, if I... Uh, in nation. Uh, the Pima have Zuni and the Mesclarano. I, I don't know where those are. I haven't met them yet, but they might actually be weaker. I will continue finishing this cling, just to have it. Alright, but uh, that is about it. I'm not going to attack them. But this is the age of absolutism, it is just rife. Multicultural nation, uh, sorry, in order to gain more points, we want to be a multicultural nation. This is very easy for us to do. Let's go to our country. We haven't accepted yet Filipino. Well, we're definitely taking some Filipino in order to us. And I guess we can either accept Moluccan or another culture. I don't really want to do Moluccan. But, um... I don't see us getting additional cultures in here. I mean, this culture... This is a Sumatran culture. But I don't see us getting quickly going to war with Siak in any time soon. But I... We'll have to see if we can manage that. Other things we can do is form free trade companies. Well, we know that we have areas in three different trade companies, because otherwise we couldn't do it. But how to form them is, for me, unknown. I know I can... This is a training port. This is not a trading company. I, I, I don't know exactly how to make that work. I have to blatantly admit... Because this is not an estate thing. I have no idea how to, how, to, how to make this work. Uh, <laughs> trade port. Let me just first go to economic map mode. Trade goods. Trade value. Trade. Is there anywhere where I can see trade companies? Trade leagues is also different. I really don't know how this works. So, if anyone knows anything, do let me know. Because I have no idea how to get the trade companies going. And uh, that's something we would like for abs in the age of absolutism. The other one is potential for a large army. We need to build a large army if we want that. But unfortunately, we won't be able to do that anytime soon. Another thing we do is multiple universities. We don't have the tech. Absolutism, 290. We might be able to do that. Emperor of China with a mandate over 90. Uh, no. That is... And funny thing is this saves mandate over 50 instead of... Oh, sorry, it says 50. What, 90? Oh, win. Be part of the victorious side in the religious league war. Well, that A already took place, so I can't. And B, yeah, that is meany because that's only four people that live in that region. Uh, yeah, it is just not funny. Just, just not. But, um... We'll have to see what we can do here. In order to, uh, well, gain some absolutism. One of the ways to do it is... Mm, sorry, I need to go to Rebels. Over here. We can handle these Separatists. Now, these are extremely small Separatists, but by handling them... Oh, sorry, they already boosted down below. Um, well, actually, we might be able to do that by absolutism, by the way. Let me just first focus on that. There's a base value. I gained some trickling in because of the, the changes that we made. But what it does is it gives you... Well, I have to show you. But there are a few ways to gain absolutism. Mm, is there... There it is. By harsh treatment, increase stability, decrease autonomy, and strength of government. Well, wait a second. Decrease autonomy, you say? Why don't I decrease autonomy over here? Here. And here. And voila. Now I have again 
a reason to harsh treatment these guys if they go over 30%. Which would give me absolutism. Now that we've done this three times already, uh, finding the right thing is always a problem for me. There we go. We have 1% absolutism, which gives me administrative efficiency and foreign core duration. So it's harder for them to have their cores maintained in our nation, and it's easier for us to core things. Eee, now that is a pretty good bonus. Hello. And yes, we have five colonies once again. Um, we would like to form California. Uh, so we need, I believe, uh, one more province to become part of it. Uh, where can I see then again the dynastic... Regions? No. Colonial, yeah, Colonial California. So I can go also down here into this territory if I like. And it all will be part of a new California. So this shouldn't become an, a nation for ourselves, which is quite nice. National unrest, uh, again, sure. Don't think it's really needed, but whatever. And I can make states. Alto California. Do I need to make Alto California a state before it works? Maybe I do. Maybe I don't. I don't know. Uh, and yes, we're trying to integrate Kutai over here. If you're case you're wondering, the other two, uh, they're still a little pissy, but they're, they're starting to turn around. Uh-oh. We find it, uh, but they're just... Apparently made people mad. Well, that's not... Ooh, yes, Grand New World Charter. Please do that. Uh, Grand Monopoly Charge. Seek support of the clergy. Establish New World Missions. Yes, please. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Alright, we'll put... That's not good. I didn't see that we... Well, we're gonna take out a loan. We're gonna take out a mighty big loan. Whoa, that came down really slowly. Game is uh, having a little bit of a chug. Yeah, and uh, England is over here. We may want to get that. He has a trade company, isn't this? Yeah. How did you establish that? A, I want to fabricate a claim here. But how did you establish this as a trade company? And where do I see this? That's buildings. So I'm g probably going to make this the last recording I do for uh, today. And I've made quite a few of them today. So this might be just time in general to do that. But uh, yeah, we uh, we are considering making a trade companies in order to uh, make the age of absolutism perhaps interesting for us. Because if we have the right one... Here, yearly absolutism plus one. That is the one we want. So... Basically, uh, uh, the other one is interesting. No, where was it? Autonomy change cooldown minus 50%. So you can do it longer or harsh treatment stronger. And then you can get uh, other things to work out. Here, handle them. It's only 58, but it gives us increased absolutism. So this is the way we are we're making our country work. Uh, why don't you lower inflation? Thank you. Excellent. So thanks to the fact that we actually were not nice to these people, we're doing better. Because we are a country that loves to be on top. Well, uh, oh, there it is actually. Discipline also. That is a good one to gain as well. Because then you fight better. So yeah. Uh, da -da -da. Run at full speed. We would like to get... I just, I just realized I never thought about how we're going to name our nation over here. Because... Okay, wait, wait. Also all fours. Okay, good. Um, because this is going to be a colonial nation, and I have not figured out a name yet for them. I'm not sure if I'm going to get them in this episode. That's one too far. Uh, Holy Roman Empire, sure. 
vote on the same guy, it will not help you. Excellent. Additional production in Lombok, that is indeed excellent. But we, uh, we're going to make an, uh, a nation over here, and then maybe we're going to go also make a nation up here. But uh, this is going to be a... Uh, although I really would also would like to get some of the islands over here. Let me know in the comments. Once again, this is going to be my last episode that I will record today. So, um... Why did I make... Covert actions? Oh, you've gone away. Great. That's why I... Can't make a claim anymore on Tohono. Because you... Skin adult. Uh, sure. Tolerance of heretics. Go. Years of separatism. Also really, really good. For maximum mode cultures. I, I love the humanist trait. The humanist idea group. It is possibly my favorite group. Although I do like me also sometimes uh, to go actually the other route. And go hardcore religious. But yeah, a little bit more ideas. And we get religious unity. Which is nice. Uh, our vassals. I think you could use some... Uh, yeah, you definitely can use some kissy kissy. Take some kissy kissy. Uh, gain 100% support for colonialism. Oh, yes! Oh, wait, I lose a thousand ducats. Well, I'm gonna take out a second loan. We have two loans now that we're going to have to repay, but we gain support for colonialism. So if I may go into the province. Yeah. Global trade is also spreading over here. Good. We have now colonialism. Renaissance is spreading. We're finally getting somewhere. We really ought to now bank a lot of points. When when we get them both, some of these tanks are going to cost so little points, it will be crazy. I mean, we're far behind now. I am very well aware of that, but after that, it will become much better. Well, actually, I just uh, died. I, I, I will become better, except that uh, I guess I will be better in death. No more pain, or something silly like that. Um, we're actually going to colonize again over here. Guam? Where are we going to go? We had a nice island open group over here, right? Some Something had here a decent score. Five. Seven. Who is over here? Aragon is. <laughs> hmm, just too late. And th oh, this is Portugal. And this is Aragon. They've come from the uh, east. The problem is I I, re I wish I knew where the heck the areas lie, lay. Uh, what do I want to do? I would like to have some of the. Here's also somebody also from Aragon. All right, so the islands around here are taken are taken from us. We have Hawaii, but everything else in between is starting to, to, to be taken. Then I guess we're going to have to go full bunkers on, on taking this. And getting ready to defeat Siak. Because the Europeans are now over here. I, I can't stop that. No, you know what? We'll, we'll start in, uh, indeed going to the northern point, from the southern pole to the northern pole. Uh, in a different way, our empire will be an empire where the sun don't set. Uh, national. Powerful nobles. We don't even have nobles anymore. 
just so silly, but whatever. You're horrible. We <laughs> just can't get any good generals because... Well, we don't have a lot of army tradition, for instance. Mm. You are still very, very unfaithful. But we have enough prestige that I'm willing to hit the button on you and you. So, Sunda, you are now happy enough that I could annex you. So, let's just pull back from England for a moment. For a moment, he says, and then it takes forever because that's how... Oh, shoot, I forgot to send out a colonist. Because I'm annoyed with all the islands that are grabbed away from me. Um... No, 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 we did send the colonists. We sent the colonists over here. What am I saying? Um... I, I don't really care about that. Okay, so, Sunda. If I would annex you... You will be done by no November of 1625. When are you done? November 1627. Alright, so I can wait two more years and then I should start with Sunda. Let me just butter him up already then. So that he is not going to, to suddenly change his mind about this. And uh, we're gonna annex this one as well. Gonna annex Sunda and Kutai at the same moment. That's the idea. Should keep that constantly in mind. Alright, you got it. Kodiak, you have also started. Kodiak. Sounds a bit like Kodak. The uh, company of uh, cameras. Excellent. Well done. Uh, but yeah, the, f the Philippines are mine, so this is the island group. I'm, I'm pretty okay with it. Just a little annoyed that they come over here, but that's the problem. I if you want to go everywhere, you're just... You're, you're going to fall out on something. Something has got to give. I think I need to core this. For this to work. Uh, yeah, we'll take the ducats. Excellent. Now, I wonder, when when does this become a nation? I've now caught a few things. Oh, and now you want another seat again. In Parliament. Uh, the, uh, this one didn't have one yet. There you go. I don't know if this is the correct way to do I thought you need a cordon. Before the uh, nation could appear. But I hope that in this episode we can make the nation appear. Recall diplomat from Sunda. Sunda, how are you? There we go, harsh treatment. Harsh treatment again. Get that absolutism going. We have absolutely a diplomat descent. November of 26, November of 27. So in, a v in a v one year from now, we need to hit the go button. Siak has become quite a powerhouse over here. Maybe Siak is willing to with me to go to battle against uh, them. Yeah, I should start mm, fabricating again on England. Just to get some... Our spy network can really drop, but... High liberty desire. Yeah, you're still annoyed, but... 
I think we'll be fine in the end. And fourth religion, did you actually do something with it, Sunda? No, so in the, f in the end uh, it was very ineffective. Possibly if I'd chosen religious then it would have been a little bit more useful. We have another colonist that we're apparently not using. I sent you to... Yeah, to Tarshi. Okay. Yeah, they have taken these island groups. I'm just gonna have to accept that. I could take these smaller... Uh, oh. See, they have also uh, landed over here. The European powers, uh, they, they, uh, they are, uh, yeah, they, they, uh, they have not gone completely for colonizing one continent. They, they, they are sometimes a wee bit random of where they go. April. April 27, so it just, we gotta hit November. November. Nothing may distract me from November. Remember, remember, the 5th of November. Guy Fox, who I actually share a name with, because Guy is not his first name. So if you're interested in what my first name is, go look up Guy Fox. A military leader leaves our court loose. Military power or widespread condemnation will hurt our relations with all other pagan... Fine, we'll lose military power. Jeez. Land maintenance modifier, I guess. Yeesh. August. We did send a colonist out, right? Are we not wasting a colonist? Yeah, we are. Oh, whoa, oh! Pause. Did England just declare war upon us? Yeah, with Portugal included. They uh, have a lot of nerve. Uh, this is not what I enjoy, mind you. And it will distract me from something I am way more interested in. But, uh, okay. England signs colonialism on me. What does what mean? What, uh, take the colony of Panay in Asia. Panay. Panay. Which colony do I need to defend? They want this part. Screw you. Seriously. <laughs> the funny thing is now that Seahawk is on our side. Ash should be... Ligor should also be on our side, right? No? Did you break our alliance? Yes, you did, you dirty bastard. Alright, Ligor was not to be trusted. Um... We're just gonna have to take some uh, things. The other thing is that Portugal is in on it. Not Aragon, mind you, but Portugal is. So we could go in here and just take the colony. Which is what I think we shall do. The problem is that there are ships here of Great Britain as well. Mm, need to think about how to go about this. Is this Great Britain? No, this is Aragon. Uh, Nove October, November. Okay, we're, we're, we're not too late. You cannot annex a vassal when you're at war. You blocked me. Ah, uh, this is so meany. This is... I, I could have annexed him. And could have done it right at the right time. I... I have no words. I have no words for this. Yeah, sure. 
That is a good air. 462. I assume he's the backup of this one. Truce with Bataille has ended. Sure. That actually means we could attack them. Without uh, getting Siak involved. Alright, well, we have now taken hold of this province. That he, he just, he cock blocks me for... This is just... <laughs> I can't have... Oh, that is so badly timed. Hopefully their colonialism is just a thing they're gonna say from the yeah, well and not do much. But you can't rely on that. I'm going to take a risk though. And go to Portugal, because Portugal is also in on this. This means that Port Portuguese Mexico is in on this. Which means these guys are kinda boned. Anyways, this is this is what my thinking is. It, we're boned if we don't do something. Gonna try and take these islands. The problem is, it may seem... Uh, repay loan. And we're gonna repay the other one as well, because that's what we were... Repay all loans. What we were waiting on. Um... Uh, so, I want you to go there. And I want the other one to go there. Because we kind of... Look, it seems like it's going alright now, but if they suddenly come in here with their huge-ass fleet, and don't you believe for one second that, that England doesn't have a huge fleet, we're screwed. The big thing we have on England is that we are fighting locally. Siak has taken that, alright. I'm willing to give that to them, actually, for helping me out. We need also our heavies available. Ooh. Well, this is interesting, that is for sure. Tun. For certain. Go. Come on. Land. Land your bat. There you go. Take those things. That's another idea. Years of separatism. You know, that could actually be useful for us in this war. So, transport off. I want to see the ships, thank you. Okay, we have now gained those parts. Um... Uh, we'll lose the army tradition for our professionalism. And then you, I would like you... Siege view? I would like you to seize the colony. Oh, we need to control the province to seize it. Alright. That's now ours. So this is already going to be ours regardless well that's not true because if they they win the war things will change but right now we have taken at least that little piece and should we go once to war of aragon 
for some other known reason, we'll have to deal with France as well. That's the problem. Because <clears throat> they are leading a PU over them. Don't see it anymore. Wait, did you lose the PU over France? No, no, here. There's a junior partner on the Aragon. Maybe, maybe, maybe we can support once they're... Uh, Thank you. I would like to see. I know we have high naval attrition. That's ours now. <sighs> Not saying this is a good idea, <laughs> but <laughs> at least it's ours right now. <laughs> uh, we have way too many colonies. I am well aware of that. So we're once we have taken, uh, completed Alut and completed Mentawai. We're going to send our colonists to the provinces that we just claimed. I'm going to go a little over time here. So that I... Because I need to build in a pause. Our glorious armies are under attack on their... Ah! They... Killed me. Yeah, this is what I said. They... They're going to go s somewhere. So... It was... It would have been illogical... That they wouldn't go somewhere. There's a, a fleet. Yes, we have some colonists to send. Doubt that we'll be in time to 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 prevent that from becoming English, but we'll have to see. Uh, oof. It, it might be that this is just uh, Europe knocking on our door and we are gonna go, well, we're fucked. Also, ending of monetization. I want the cogs to go there, thank you. Um, but this is... This is weird. We got ticking war score because we hold the, the target of the war. You're cogs. So I really want to stop you from landing what I assume are troops in Strait of Lombok. Alright. Let's have a naval battle. Hmm? I can't prevent this. The question is, will he do the same as we do to him? I don't know. Let's first uh, get this naval battle on the way. There we go. Well, we won the naval battle. The first one. So, you guys repair. Did that gain a lot of war score? Straight of Lombok. Yeah, but we lost... Just as much from losing our troops over here. So basically what I should do is just say goodbye. Because I can't prevent them from dying. And the same holds true for these three ships. So just prevent them from dying. This colony is just too young yet to do something about. Uh, that knocked our colonist out of that park. And we will send over here. So hopefully we can get this one to switch back to, to, to Aboriginal. But, um, interesting war. I'm going to end the episode over here. England has declared war upon us. We are doing fine. If we want to talk, talk to England. Hmm. Uh, let's. It has no more use to, to talk to, to, to Sunda. And I, I feel like I don't dare to go on speed 4. Because every m if we can prevent them from landing on the, our coasts, that's everything. Like, you know, that that is really everything. Um, I will send our fifth colonist up here. Hopefully they will leave us a little bit alone up here. 
but they are uh, they're gonna logically now multi siege this. So I assume I don't know if this colony is it's not considered abandoned, but you've given this to what now? To Portuguese Mexico. All right. Mentawi became self-sustaining. It became Sumatran. All right. And this one has actually colonialism because it was of England for some time. Um. This is so weird. I think I will. We'll start colonizing Taiwan. Manchu is now eating Yanju. Yeah, Aragon is now Aragon is now also really cl close by. Um. No, I shouldn't do this. Hold on. Very cool. Let's just get ourselves these colonies to to rise. Get get over here. Get big there. Do something over there. What is the national decision? Converse to Christianity. No. Formalize separation of powers. Your like prestige. Huh, that would have been nice. Uh, stability at least two. Ruler has administrative skill of ritual, education, missionary strength. That would have also been nice. But, uh, right now, a little screwed. Uh, Kutai, I also think, will not be integrated until we are at peace again. Uh, they are really happy to be in this war, though. So I think it's going to take some serious amount of time until they, uh, change their tune. Uh, we may need to consider a plan of action how to uh, hop from island to island, so to speak. Uh, and colony to colony from theirs to just gain a little bit of war score. Uh, because right now, I reckon that all our war scores, yeah, ticking war scores 7.20, is just from the fact that we have the colony. The fact that we supposedly have more war score from our battles in sea are not considered part of it. Which is just weird. I mean, we wanted to go to war with them, don't get me wrong, but... England. What if we wanted this? What, what would you... What would be the... the <laughs> Sorry for the whistle. I tend to do that when I get annoyed. This is a 34 war score. Well, okay. Well, we have to see. I say we stay close to our borders. Don't do anything else stupid. Uh, let the colony of California be a little bit screwed by this war. I will finish that in this, this episode. That is mm, California done. I can't really do something about it. I'm glad I disbanded the troops that I had over there. Uh, we're fighting, for crying out loud anyways, uh, troops that we can't handle. Uh, right now we've got this. Maybe I should go on a boat and leave these island groups. I'm going to stop the recordings over here. I'm going to wait for recording new episodes. Let me know in the comments what you think about our war strategy. Uh, California is lost. There's a chance also that this will be lost. Because I don't know if they know of it and then will go up or if they will not do it. Losing great power status. Yeah, I really wish I could kind of tell them. We'll do more, one more harsh treatment because, hey, absolutism is good. We don't really uh, care about the other ways. What, what Discipline is only 0 0.2%, but hey, it's good. Our max absolutism is 91. Why, why I thought it was 94 for a moment. Oh, legitimacy has dropped. Great power is a part of it. Maybe, who knows what we will get out of here. Um... 
Is Ethiopia one of our rivals? Yes. Yo, send an insult. Take that. Get, get, get the, the plus five bonus. I can't see. Oh! Lot of cogs. The coast of Arche. He's going over here. Are you going to go over here? Is that your idea? I don't know. But we beat we've beaten them there again. But that wasn't even considered a proper battle. Well, I really have to end the episode. Uh, it is interesting to see what's going to happen. Uh, they are definitely trying to land troops. I think the only way to beat them is to be stronger on uh, in the seas. Where are you going? Nicobar Islands. Yeah, I think he's probably going to go somewhere over here. Or up there. Didn't realize you had that part as well. But uh, yeah, I think the best way to defeat England here is to be the stronger person in the sea. And that is the way to keep their navies away from our mainland so they can't land. Because their troops are just way stronger than ours. Let me know what you think about the tactic. Let me know what you think about the series. Let me know what you think. I say thank you for watching and remember, great peril yields great beauty.